everybody, his eye, Patrick Starr from the hit show SpongeBob SquarePants. July 11th, I took requests for people to tell me what they want me to say in the Patrick voice. Because it's been, what, years since the last upload of that? So I thought I'd do it with the new viewers and uh, just see how see how stuff went. I ran this poll on uh, on YouTube community tab and I also did it on Twitter. So uh, if you want to be in one of these, uh, reply to my community posts, check out my Twitter, or whatever you have to do. Anyways, let's get to saying shit. Woo! I can't roll my R's, but I'll try this one. Boo, skibbity, dum, 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 yes, yes. Oh my God, I'm not redoing that. I'm not redoing that. I'm the old Patrick. I want normal kelp soda. Follow Noise Plush on Twitter. Shameless promotion. In my reply section. Instead of Bikini Bottom, what if, hear me out, what if it was called Ohio Yacht? I hate my. Nobody ever asks, how is Patrick? SpongeBob, what do you mean I sound like Sans? Policy is always a party. What does that mean? <laughs> oh my god. Gada, 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 gada. Oh. <laughs> Another person said skibbity. No, no. PL. Oh my goodness, it's the real SpongeBob on X. Hey, SpongeBob. Why is it called X? Oh, I'm gonna butcher this. I don't. Hola, soy Patricio. Skibbity toilet is low key kind of peak. One both of these nuts, Lamel. <laughs> Connection terminated. Oh uh, shit, I don't want to kill you. Anyway, where's my Happy Meal? There's piss everywhere! SpongeBob, how? Kirk is gay, Robert's gay, Lars is gay, but the gayest is a James. I don't get why people flush their dead fish down the toilet. It's such a waste of protein. Wait, what? Hello, every- oh, okay. Hello, everybody! My name is Markiplier, and welcome to Five Nights at Freddy's, an indie horror game that you guys suggested in mass, and I saw that Yummy Mash played it and said it was really, really good. So I'm very eager to see what it's up. And that is a terrifying animatronic bear. Family Pizzeria looking for security guard to work the night shift. Oh. 12 a.m. The first night. If I didn't want to stay the first night, why would I stay any more than five? Why I stay any more than two? Hello? Okay. If I wake up my family, this is all your fault. It is 3.30 a.m. as I'm recording this. The security system takes control of Squidward's house and begins attacking the city, leaving the mayor to give Squidward community service for the damage he caused, even though SpongeBob and I were in his house the whole fucking time and were responsible for everything. Yeah! Fuck this episode! Connection terminated. I'm sorry to interrupt you, Elizabeth, if you still even remember that name, but I'm afraid you've been misinformed. You're not here to receive a gift, nor have you been called here by the individual you assume. Although, you have indeed been called. You've all been called here into a labyrinth of sounds and smells, misdirection, and misfortune. A labyrinth with no exit, a maze with no prize. You don't even realize that you're trapped. Your lust of blood has driven you in endless circles, chasing the cries of children in some unseen chamber, always seeming so near. It's somehow out of reach, but you will never find them. None of you will. This is where your story ends. And to you, my brave volunteer, who somehow found this job listing not intended for you. Although, there was a way out planned for you. I have a feeling that's not what you want. I have a feeling that you're right where you want to be. I'm remaining as well. I am nearby. This place will not be remembered, and the memory of everything that started this can finally begin to fade away, as the agony of every tragedy should. And to you monsters trapped in the corridors, be still and give up your spirits. They don't belong to you. As for most of you, I believe there is peace and, perhaps, warm waiting for you after the smoke clears. Although, for one of you, the darkest pit of hell has opened to swallow you whole. So don't keep the devil waiting, friend. My daughter, if you can hear me, I knew you'd return as well. It's in your nature to protect the innocent. I'm sorry that on that day, the day you were shut out and left to die, no one was there to lift you up in their arms. The way you lifted others in yours. And then what became of you, I should have known. 
You wouldn't be so content to disappear. Not my daughter, I couldn't save you then. So, let me save you now. It's time to rest, for you, and for those you have carried in your arms. This ends, for all of us, and communication. I love my best friend in the whole wide world, Spongebob, colon D. <laughs> and that was all the submissions I got for this one. Uh, stay tuned, uh, check my Twitter every so often, maybe we'll do another one of these. I don't really know, it just depends on how well this video does. If this video does well, I'll do another one, if not, then, I mean, I guess this series is cancelled, but I had fun doing this. And no, I'm still not singing the AVGN theme song.